hi guys welcome back this is Srikant today in this video we will be talking about uh, how to create the column store index in SQL Server 2012 as I said in my earlier video the in SQL Server we in SQL Server 2012 we can only create a non clustered column store index in in SQL Server 2014 we can create the cluster column store index the difference is basically in non cluster column store index we can't update the data once uh, we have created the column store index on that we for that if you want to do so we have to first drop the index then you need to recreate that non cluster index so this can this could be a limitation because a lot of people requested to microsoft and microsoft uh, comes with a solution in sql server 2014 with the updatable uh, updatable column store index right and that index we call it as the cluster column store index okay so in this video i will be showing you uh, create a non cluster column store index from gui and from tsql okay so first of all we should have a table on which we have to the column store so <clears throat> this is my table demos demo new let's see how many data how many records it has uh, when I see this table, I can see only two records in it. Okay, great. Let's try to insert into some data, a lot of data. Before that, I think I need to add one column into it. Add name where care of 100,000. Let's insert some 10,000 record more than that. Select one comma. She come. Go. Okay, let's let's execute it. So uh, I'm going to show you how we can create the non cluster column store index. So first of all, we need to go uh, to the table. Then in the table, we need to go for the index. Option. There we can see the index folder there, right? So what we need to do there, we need to cl right click on the index, new index. Then we will see the different index option, uh, primary XML cluster index. Now we also, also see a non cluster column store index just click it on when we click on this one we'll see there are pop-up will come and the pop-up will ask a few things like on which table it is going to create an index name do you if you want to change you can change it i don't want to change so i'm not changing the name then index type non cluster column store then here we need to specify on which column we have do a non cluster column store index this i'm selecting both column next is options maximum degree of parallelism then stretch and then extend it okay uh, i can click on the script so i can also see and see the scripts okay let's click on the okay when i click on okay a non cluster column string index will be created from gnc here when you click on it you will see uh, that the old pop-up itself here you can also again modify the index structure okay this is from the GUI now I will show you how we can create it from the uh, tsql one okay so syntax is very simple it's like a normal index creation just create non cluster index just add one extra word there called as a column stroke and then specify the name for the index then on which table you have to do it then specify the column name You can specify a drop existing of on if you want to so if you don't want to do you can just ignore it and just run it this is also one of the way where we can create a non cluster column store index from the tsql hope you like our video regarding how to create the non cluster column store index in sql server thanks for watching have a great day